I'll show you how to do the JavaScript one certification maintenance summer 23. Uh, in the second part, I'm not going to do the first part. It's a multiple choice questions. Um, uh, get hands on with conditional directives and refs. Conditional directives are else, else ifs, and then refs are reference of uh, shallow DOMs uh, and DOMs. So you can refer from somewhere else using ref tag. Um, first, you have to um, uh, uh, do these exercises. What you do here, you create a child and then put the code there. You modernize with the new enhancements. You create a new child lightning web component, replace this with the child.java.js or the JavaScript. Mm. Create a new parent uh, lightning web component, replace this uh, JavaScript section with um, in uh, parent.js. The next one is a metadata file. Put the whole thing in the uh, parent JS metadata.xml. This is a parent.html. HTML. You copy and paste in the um, parent.html. Then you place in the uh, right side and uh, right side of the account right here where my cursor is. As you can, I finished it. So you have to do everything in the um, uh, uh, the Visual Studio code as you know it. So I have created child uh, here, right? Child here. And also I have created parent. Um, so this is parent. Uh, yeah, I changed the um, else if here, here and here and also um, for this uh, also um, here this is a reference here so I had to refer in the Java's parent one here uh, so I commented out this section here I put this section this dot refs dot child so it refers to the HTML file DOM section here shallow DOM here um, when you instantiate uh, a child component, you added a reference. And also, again, I, as I said, I changed the here, else, if this, set, this part and this part as well. Let's look at the code. This is hardly readable. Let I'll show you uh, the code in a presentation. Uh, so this is a parent.html. Here you have to uh, put the, the um, let me here, lwc if part, this is a parent.html. Uh, you have to use a new directives, lwc colon if, and then account.data with it uh, curly brackets. And here, uh, also, the LWC colon else here, you have to put it here. And for the reference uh, uh, item, you have to add uh, after, within this uh, angular brackets. Here you instantiate a child lining web component here. You have to put LWC colon refs equals within parents synthesis child um, so it gives a reference to a child and then um, then you go to uh, javascript file parent.javascript file all you have to do is right here where my cursor is you comment out this template query selector what you uh, use you are using the query selector to uh, retrieve the child component um, all you have to do is uh, you have to put this dot refs dot child so it it refers a child component so yeah so I'll um, stay here in the first uh, 
screen which is a html file of pa uh, uh, parent so parent.html so you can read it few minutes and then i'll move on to this parent.js you can uh, write it down what i did here you take your time all i did was lwc colon if lwc colon else here right here i i um, remove the legacy uh, else if um, parts and put right here and right here and then uh, add lwc ref child here right here and also i put this ref dot child this these are the um, uh, this is the part I added. I commented out this in the parent.javascript file. Okay, I uh, change the color of the areas where I uh, updated in the parent.html. You can see here. And then also I um, added a reference to a child here. I use a new LWCU tag child here. I'll stay here for a few minutes. This is the parent.html file. This is a parent.javascript file. Parent.js. All I did was I commented out this template, query select, and added this.ref.child. This will take care of that. 